for years I've been saying that universities all over the world are indoctrinating our kids. And when I went down a few years back and did uh, an interview very close to the centre of um, Dublin, there's a university there, and they were as woke as you like and as brainwashed as they like. And I was thinking, how would you reverse this? How could you change these kids' opinions from the poison they've had indoctrinated into them to where we actually are? Well, it seems that they've found a way, the left have found a way of doing this for me and others. So, the kids broke up, uh, I say kids, the university students broke up and they went home. And all of these halls of residence became available, so they moved the Ukrainians into it. Well, it turns out the Ukrainians have refused to move, they're not having it. Because whether there's nowhere to put them and they've got to put them into tents and they don't want that, well, I think that was going to be the case. So what's actually happened? They've stayed put, and the university um, students have had to go into tents. Now, how many, I'm not sure, but there's one group that are by the, uh, the motorway, there's a few others down by the beach, and there's others pitched up elsewhere. Now, it's said that even with a thousand, somebody said to me a thousand pounds, but I think it's probably more like a thousand euro, you cannot find a property in Southern Ireland around the area. Well, I predicted, years ago that there would be over a million uh, immigrants piling into Southern Ireland, uh, but I gave a 10 year period, I was wrong, it's happened a lot faster than that. So naturally there is a housing shortage. And there's a housing shortage for people that want to buy or who want to rent, and now obviously it's students, they want to rent. So whilst trying to be good students and get a great education, they've got to go back to a 10. I mean, that's dedication to education. But can you imagine how that's reversing all the indoctrination? I always said they left it eat themselves, but I didn't think they'd do it this way. But there it is. Students in tents so that Ukrainians can live in better comfort. Just... I'll see you on the next video.